Hi, this is PR Sundar. Welcome to Pre-Market Report, sponsored by TaxBuddy.com, a leading tax filing portal in India. Asian markets are down, US futures are lower, and SGX Nifty trading are Friday's closing low. Uh, Friday's low, not closing low. In the last 45 minutes, Nifty recovered about 50-60 point, and now that 50-60 point is down. So now. SX Nifty is trading closer to yesterday's low, Friday's low. Markets all over the world are nervous ahead of US consumer price inflation data as well as the Fed meeting. Why? Because for the last one week, 10 days, whatever the data is coming from US, they are mostly not favorable to stock market. So therefore, people are expecting the consumer price inflation also to come not in favor of stock market so that is the reason for selling and the selling was uh, a decent selling for the last one week so in case if the inflation data comes lower than expected so definitely there will be some short covering so that is only uh, tomorrow in us market which will be reflecting in our market day after tomorrow so until then you know our markets are likely to be jittery and Though markets are down all over the world, uh, they are just down half a percent or maximum one percent. So there is no big sell off all over the world. And here for the last one week, FAS were net sellers on every day. And in all the five days of the week, FAS were net sellers and they have sold for more than 4000 crores. However, domestic institutions were net buyers. 4 out of the 5 trading sessions and total they have bought for more than 3500 crore. So on a net institutional selling basis uh, it was just only about 500 crore but however Nifty was down, Bank Nifty was up. So today also uh, IT stocks will definitely be in focus and many people who are not aware why my IT stocks were falling now they know why it is falling and they may short again. Uh, Infosys particularly, I checked the uh, American depository receipt. So Infosys ADR was down by 500% in US markets on Friday. So that is a very big fall. So if Infosys falls maybe 1-2% also here, so Nifty is going to be under pressure. And not only Infosys, even Wipro ADR was down by 4.5%. So one thing, IT stocks were under pressure here. Second thing, the Nasdaq was also under pressure there. So it's a combination of effect. So IT index did very, very badly. But uh, the overall damage may not be very big. So that's because uh, HDFC Bank ADR was up by 1%. So on one side strong banks, other side weak IT stocks. So it may be a tug of war, uh, who knows. Uh, for the past many weeks, uh, the SGX Nifty was not the correct indication. And uh, since we have already fallen on Friday so much, who knows today we may be outperforming the global markets also. So what SGX Nifty indicating may not be there. Uh, true indication. So uh, macro level there is nothing to worry. Uh, number one uh, crude oil falling slowly. You may remember few months before the crude oil was trading above 120 dollar per barrel. Now it is trading around 76-77 dollar. So that is a very very uh, decent correction. And number two rupee is also stabilizing between 81 and 83 per US dollar and third one FAS are selling of course but usually in the month of December FAS used to be sellers that's because you know uh, for FAS the year end closing is December so their financial year is between January uh, January and December so usually December they are lackluster month only so their activity will pick up in the month of January. 
they will be uh, setting aside fresh allocation for each country. So, now the Indian markets seems to be more favorable um, than other markets. So, they may set aside more money. So, there may be a good rally in the month of January and February, but December is going to be lackluster. So, however, if there is uh, some economic data coming in favorable stock market, if US market sees some kind of a short covering, then our market can go to uh, up to 19,000 in this month. So, therefore, the crude oil is down, rupee stabilizing, uh, FA selling nothing much to worry and uh, global markets also uh, not reacting, uh, not selling off like anything. Uh, globally, VIX is also coming down, VIX is not shooting up. So, all this point to a stable market and uh, so any buying, uh, any fall 400, 500 point in Nifty, uh, which is the case right now, uh, it may be a buying opportunity with a proper hedge. Uh, so, today we can expect Nifty to take support around 18,400. So, I am expecting Nifty to trade between 18,400 and 18,600. So, we will see how the market pans out and stocks that will be in focus will be definitely uh, Infosys and uh, Infosys TCS and HDFC Bank and HDFC. So, HDFC group is likely to do well and so if some big people want to stabilize the market, so they will buy the HDFC now. So, hope you enjoyed watching this video. Thank you for watching.